Um, Jordan Anthony, class of 2022, committed to the University of Kentucky for football and track. I'm a four-star receiver and I'm the fastest kid in the United States. Mm -hmm. Fastest kid in the United States. You're also a footballer. Um, are you similar to like Devon Allen, the 110 meter hurdler for the U.S.? Yeah, some similar, yes sir. What do you expect from this meet tomorrow here in, in, um, in Maryland? Shoot, I'm really expecting the best because this year I really haven't been pushed that much, but hopefully I come out here and get pushed by the Jamaicans. You know, it's been a big rivalry since the Olympics. When you said hopefully you'll get some push tomorrow by the Jamaicans, um, are you aware of any of the Jamaicans who are here? Uh, yes, sir. Um, the um, the 100 meter and the, uh, um, Shadir, Shamaya uh, Little and the 200 from the United States as well. Mm -hmm. Any part, I, I mean, it's, a, it's raining now, we expect a little rain tomorrow as well. Um, how will you plan to approach conditions like these? Sure, I approach the conditions the same as I had a hot sunny day. Just come out there and prepare yourself, get my, my muscles warmed and ready because it's a little cold and a little rainy, but other than that, they ain't going to stop me from doing what I got to do. When you go into competitions like these, do you set yourself targets and what will be your target tomorrow? Uh, my target is to uh, race the clock, not the people next to me because you never know, somebody might be having a bad day and you race them, shoot, you try to run against them, they might have a bad day, you might end up having a bad, bad day as well. So just run the clock and try to go sub 10. Mm -hmm. And of course, what's your ultimate goal for this year? Uh, my ultimate goal is to go sub 10 and probably 20.2 or 3. What condition are you in now? Are you close to sub 10 to 20.2? Uh, yes, sir. I'm close. I'm very close. I ran a 10.14 with no push. I was like 50 meters ahead of everybody. So hopefully I get a push there uh, tomorrow. Um, who is your role model in the sport? I know you do. Um, you you are involved in two sports. Uh, who are your role models? Shoot, my role model in yeah, track and field, almost like almost everybody role model, you saying both. Of course, everybody want to get to where he got. And for football, I really don't have one. It's probably my dad. And probably, probably Devonte Adams, cause you like nobody can guard him. So like, you just don't have an answer for him. How do you mix? How do you prepare for football and track and field? How, how difficult is it to be involved in two sports? Uh, football is a little bit difficult because it's a stop and go sport. Track, you just full of blown 100 meter, 100 miles per hour. But me trying to prepare for that, I just take like weeks or weeks off and prepare like training different different weeks. Really, it really ain't that difficult if you put your mind to it. And, and, and you mentioned Jamaica earlier. How important Jamaica, as many would know, along with the U.S., are the two top nations in sprinting. How, do you pay attention to sprinting in Jamaica? Oh uh, yes, sir. I really just watch the um, pin relays. Like they bla put some blazing times out there. So like, I'm just excited to compete against them. Really, I'm just blessed to be in this opportunity and have this moment.